Welcome, here's InterGeo TV from Stuttgart 2024. And right now here with me at the InterTV InterGeo TV stage is Peter Rummel. Um, he's director of Infrastructure Policy Advancements for Europe at Bentley Systems. Hi, Peter, good to have you here. How are you? Yes, hi <laughs> and good morning, Dennis. Uh, thanks for having us here. It's great to be back at Intergeo and we are happy to celebrate our 40th birthday. Wow, congratulations. And thank you. And we came with some good traditional portfolio. Uh, we have okay. the full bandwidth from our MicroStation solutions up to iTwin solutions and the infrastructure cloud. So welcome all guests to our booth. But we see a really big advantage in the conferences and expo stages. Mm -hmm. So we brought really the important topics for you and the, the audience. This is data management, data diversity. We see a really importance in water resilience. Yeah. We see it in the European Union with the new priorities. We see it important that the digital twin sees below the earth, understanding the underground and we are really, really helping to get the labor scarcity tackled because the best solutions need people to operate with them. Yeah, absolutely. We have a lot of challenges and we have to mm -hmm. tackle the, the to face uh, the problems. And um, yeah, so what do you actually currently see for trends at the trade show here at Intergeo? I think over the years it was, it's no longer a problem to capture data mm -hmm. or to store it or to access it. Now it's important that we um, foster the collaboration, mm -hmm. that we see the inter interdependencies between the different uh, departments and people need to start working together. So for me, openness is one of the key elements that we do leverage the technical possibilities. I think we have the three things, mindset, skill set and data set. Data set, we can tick the box and say, okay, that's, that's done. From the skill set, the technology is good enough as well. And it's a little bit the training of the employees and the decision makers. This is doing really well. But in some cases, we see the mindset where we still struggle. A hurdle to take the right decisions, hesitations. OK, so we have the technologies, but we have to take the people yes. with it. Ah, OK, so um, which of these, what you just mentioned, are the important trends for you at Bentley Systems? And um, how are you addressing them? I think we have good news with our celebration of the birthday. We can celebrate another big thing. We did acquire a company called Cesium. And they are really dedicated to bring the data to the decision makers. So it's important that they can visualize and really understand the problem and possible solutions moving forward. Mm -hmm. So we double down on openness. So it's open standards, open AI, and open source. So to really empower people that they are confident and willing to take the right decisions now. Okay, so these topics are really, um, in particular, very important for you, and so you're really also forward-looking in it. Yeah, I think it's important because we did, we have quite, his, quite some history with our infrastructure, and we see we are facing some challenges now, and we can't um, anticipate that the work of the style we work, we interact, and we, we take decisions is um, solving our problems because more or less they brought us in the situation. So we have to have a different way to approach the whole thing. And the openness, it, it, it's really important. And one element is important as well. We have used to solve problems we have today. But if you look at infrastructure, some assets last for 20, 30, 40, 50 years. So we need to have technology that people can envision a situation or a problem, how it would look like in 30 or 50 years. Mm -hmm. And this is the reason why people are hesitant to decide, because they feel uncertainty not knowing what's coming. If we are able to provide the data, explain the problem and the future problem, and help them to visualize a potential solution, this is really what brings us forward. Mm -hmm. And as I mentioned, with the openness and the technology, we can provide this kind of confidence. Mm -hmm. So where does the journey for Bentley Systems go from here? I think we made a point we are really big in infrastructure. And to be, to be clear, infrastructure won't be solved or fixed in the next two or three years. So there is still a way to go. If we think we'd like to be carbon neutral, 
2025, some people earlier. We need to tackle water, water resilience, water supply, affordable mobility. So there's a long way to go to fix our infrastructure and improve it. And to give it a little about, um, what is it, a visionary spin. Mm -hmm. Whenever somebody decides that we need to have a base on the moon and have some, have some infrastructure here, talk about terraforming on Mars or mining on other planets, I think wherever infrastructure expertise is required, Bentley Systems and our customers are more than help willing to contribute in this one. Wow, awesome, great. And so it's really um, for us a pleasure to have you here at your 40th birthday, 40 years of Bentley Systems. Mm -hmm. And thank you very much for joining us here at this year's Intergeo 2024 in Stuttgart. Yeah, thanks for having us and looking forward to see you in Frankfurt, I think, next year. Yeah, so mm -hmm. do. Thank you.